Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, no matter where you are in the world. This is Howie, and I'm here to help you win with money. In today's episode, I'm going to do my weekly summary of all my options trade. This should be the summary for end of week number 18. Let's see how I do. Before we get to this week's episode, if you're on Facebook, you can join me at Investment 102. It's a Facebook group where you can level up your investment thinking. So we're going to just paste in all the transactions. Copy. Paste. Paste again. May 5th. Paste those. May 6th is paste over here. Copy more May 6th. Paste over here. Let's go grab May 7th. I'm done with formatting. First thing I'm going to do is go up here. Let's go and hit the pivot. Refresh. Come to the next screen. Hit refresh. And I just did the pivot and everything looks okay. I didn't notice anything weird. It was a small gain this week. Not a lot of action. 22 trades. Mostly adjusting stuff. Here's a breakdown by day. The first week of May is okay. I'll talk through some trades now. So the first trade is this riot one I put a filter on. You see it, the cash secure put. If you just do this, you'll see I'm rolling down and out. Collected $57. The next trade is this one here. Riot blockchain for one day to expiration. I made $17 here. I had to let that one expire normally. So with Fastly, I did roll up and down this week. Collected a small premium, wasn't that much. $82. Remember, they missed earnings and the shares tank. So I had to adjust my options because the option is going to expire worthless. So I move it closer. That's what I did here. The next one is EA. You can see that I've been rolling for EA for the cover calls. And if you do something just like this to filter correctly, You'll see that I've been rolling. And if you do this for the last couple of weeks, I made a small profit. $180 for rolling EA. And for the most part, it's been rolling up and out. So you see I'm I started at 134, I've been 135, 136, 130, and I'm up to 140 now. So you see how rolling a cover call can be worth it. You can still collect premium and not lose too much upside. Okay, that's the end of this episode. I made a small profit this week, wasn't much. I'm hoping that my middle of May will be a little bit better. I need the market to flatten out or go down slightly, and that's what I'm looking forward to. Let me know what you're trading. Let me know how your year has been going. As always, let's do this together. Let's do this $1 at a time, and have a profitable day. Bye-bye.